feel any signs of vertigo or any signs of feeling imbalance after I put a bit of pressure on your eyes. Okay, not so much. Perfect, okay. I'm going to get out my pen light now and I'm going to see how your eye reacts. Okay, I'm looking for your pupil. So, I'm going to ask you to look where my hand is wiggling. Don't look at the light. I'm going to shine that next to you, okay? Keep looking at where my hand is wiggling. Good. Other eye. Look where my hand is wiggling. Let me know how many fingers. 
fingers am I holding up? Perfect. How many fingers am I holding up now? Good. How many fingers am I holding up now? Good. And how many fingers am I holding up now? Good. Okay. Other eye. Let me know. How many fingers am I holding up? Good. How many fingers am I holding up? fingers am I holding up? Good. And how many fingers am I holding up? Good. Okay, so it appears that your left and your right eye are pretty similar. Okay, and we are going to move on to a eye lens exam. You may have seen it behind me, but we're going to test the prescriptions of your eyes. Okay, before we begin that though, I'm going to test your peripheral vision just pretty quickly, okay? What I want you to let me know is when my hands move out of your visual field. I always test this before to see if the glasses are a fit for you. Good. So, I'll give you an example. My hands are probably out of your peripheral vision now, correct? Good. Just say yes when my hands are out of your peripheral vision. Are you ready? Keep focus. Let's begin. Good. Good. Good.
this tester lens one. And what do you see? Yes, the lens is on your face. I will give you one without, two with. What do you see? Okay, not so much going on. Perfect. Any difference? Not really. Okay, good. This is the trial lens. It's almost like a placebo effect. <laughs> okay. Now let's continue. Lens 2. Okay. Now lens 2 is on your face. Now what do you see going on? Okay, so it appears that... I'll have to show you lens 1 again without. Okay. 1 without. 2 with. 1 without. And 2 with. <laughs> Any difference? Okay. Perfect. So, this one actually is a slight blur. It is almost unseeable. Okay. Are you ready for tester lens 3? Perfect. Now, one without and two with. Any difference? This is one without. And this is two with. Any difference with what you see? Okay, and it is red. Very good. Perfect. So, I'm going to perform something now called the red eye or red dot test. What this is is to see if you can identify other colors whilst the red is over your eye. Okay. Good. So, I'm going to get my pen light. Let me know what color is the light. Is the light red or is it blue? Very good. It is red. Okay. Now a little closer. Is the light red or is it blue? Let me know. Okay. It is still red. Okay. I'm going to put the light far away. Okay. Is the light red or is the light blue? Okay, it is red. Okay, I'm gonna put the light very close to the lens now. Is the light red or is the light blue? Okay, do you see the color of the light shift between the red and the blue? To some, it might also look like it's turning from yellow to white. Is that happening at all? Okay. I'm going to move it around. Let me know if that happens at all. Okay, it does. Good. Let me know if it does. Good. Perfect. Okay. Now, continuing with the red light test. How many fingers am I holding up? It is five. Good. How many fingers am I holding up? Two. Good. How many fingers am I holding up? Three. Marvelous. How many fingers am I holding up now? One. Good. Okay. I'm going to show you a little remote I have that has several different colors on it. Okay. Can you tell that on the remote there are different shades and colors? Or do they all look like different shades of red? Okay. Okay, they look like different shades of red. Okay, any idea what this color is that well, my finger is on right there? Any idea? Do you think that was red before or do you think it was another color? Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. And that is the red light exam. Perfect. That is typically our tester lens because we're also trying to see dynamically inside the eye. Red is the color that travels the farthest, and it actually can transform colors magnificently. I'll show you the remote. This is the remote that I was using. The 
color I was pointing at was this one, which was a blue, right there. <laughs> and we typically use these remotes specifically for eye color tests. Good job. Okay, now we're going to find your prescription. I'm going to go from the strongest prescription down to the lowest. Okay, let's begin.
glasses. That's typically the opposite with the glasses, okay? Good. Okay, are you ready? It appears that the prescription of your convex sphere size was negative 0.75, which is very good. I would say that's out of 20 out of 20 vision. That is a 15 out of 20 vision.
and that is only to test properly for this portion of the exam, okay? Very good, relax. might look a little different now. Can you tell? Yeah, they look great though still. Are you ready for your first test? Let's begin. Do you know what number is in front of you? Okay, let's see if you can see that number. Let me know. Are you able to see the number? Okay, and the background is gray. The number. 
numbers are pink and purple. <laughs> I have a difficulty seeing some purple, so to me these look almost identical. Okay, and are you ready for the final exam? This is the most difficult part of the test, I promise you. I have a photo in front of me that has two separate trails. I'm going to ask you to take your finger and I want you to trace the trail that is at the top. Okay, so put your hand on the paper and to the best of your ability, I want you to trace the trail that is at the top. Okay, now try again. Same for the one on the bottom. Very good. You did fantastic. I'm proud of you. Good job. Now I get to write down your prescription and I get to write down your assessment for this. All we're going to do is if there is a problem with the change in color, we write that down on your driver's license and our passport. Good. And are you ready for the final part of your test? We are going to try on some glasses and see which ones fit you best. Are you ready? Let's begin. I have a very large selection of designer glasses that happen to be super fancy. And if you'd like any of the five here, you just let me know. The first ones we have here are gorgeous. They are Gucci. Very fancy designer. You can see from the side, these are so beautiful. And let's see if these fit your style. I'm just going to place that around your face. Okay. And how do you feel? Okay, let me show you a mirror. Okay, I think these are a little bit modern, a little bit fun. Yes. Okay, let's try another now. These ones are gorgeous, super fun if you're kind of more of a modern person. Yeah. On to the next. Stunning. These are Valentino designer. And we're going to see if you like a pair like this. They are super pretty and they are absolutely perfect for looking very smart and bold. I'm going to place this right there. Okay. And how do you feel? Perfect. Let me show you the mirror that's in front of you. Take a look. Okay, yes, a little bit, a little bit 70s, a little bit bold. Are you liking it? Yes or no? Okay, that's a yes. Perfect. Okay. We have, these ones are actually my favorite. A lot of the clientele here, here they call them the Harry Potter glasses. But these are really stunning frames. We have these right there. These are also Gucci, very designer. But let's see if you like the Harry Potter glasses. Okay. Okay, let's see. Put that right there. How do you feel? Do you feel like the boy who lived? Very good. And these actually give you a very good refined look. Are you a fan? Do you think that they look a little bit silly like a costume? Okay, these are a no. That's okay. 
these ones are handmade and custom by the glasses technician here in the clinic. This is a gorgeous frame. Very classic. And these look super unique. Let's try these on. Okay. How do you feel with the lenses? I see a smile on your face. This one might be it, you think? We'll find out very soon. Super. Okay. These ones are beautiful frames. And yes, one of our technicians does make the frames here. She is very good and very skilled. Now, on to the last pair. These ones are aviators. So, these ones are gorgeous. I think these would fit your face perfectly well. Especially because you have very nice cheekbones. So, these are the classic aviators. Let's put these on. I'm personally a fan of these ones always. Okay. Okay, I see that smile. You like the aviators? Yeah, they actually do make your cheekbones again look super good. And because of the metal frame, that complements your face very well. Okay. So, which one shall we go with? The aviators. I knew it. Okay, we're gonna send these in on the technicians. I'll let you know in about five business days. We'll call you when the glasses are finished. Now, would you like to add anything to the glasses? What I mean by that is, I always like to alert people about this. We do have blue light lenses. And what these blue light lenses do is that they actually stop you from getting headaches when you're looking at a screen for over two hours a day. Would you like that included? Gorgeous. Okay, well, I think the exam is finished now. Thank you so much for completing and sitting here for that long. I really do appreciate that, okay? Yes. Thank you so much. And we'll have your glasses again in five to two, typically five to ten business days, but we're not that busy, so I'll say five. Okay. And I will also send you an email within the next six hours with the final results of your tests. Okay. So come back in when the glasses are ready and pick them up. Thank you so much for coming on by for your detailed eye exam today. And thank you for having patience with me and sitting here for this long. Yes. Have a great rest of your day now, okay? And again, I was Dr. I. Bye now. Cheers and enjoy the rest of 